In this video, I'm going to unbox a brand new Well Chalin home blood pressure monitor. I'll show you the features, how to set it up, and we'll take a blood pressure test to show you how it works. If you want to see more blood pressure videos like this one, click the subscribe button and the bell icon. Home monitoring has a ton of benefits, and there's no better way to do it than with the Welch Allen Monitor. It's a company based in the United States and in existence for over 100 years. They're more associated with medical facilities and hospitals than home products, which makes this monitor so great because you can get the highest quality standards in your home at an affordable price. I already have one myself. This is one that a friend purchased and lent it to me so I can make this video. This is the box that it comes in. They have two compartments. On the right, you'll see the instruction booklet and the blood pressure cuff itself. On the left, they have an informational leaflet and the monitor. It comes in a plastic bag. It also has a protective covering over the screen, which you can peel off and remove. This is the power button. On the right side, there's nothing. On the left side, you have the air supply tube connector. And on the rear, you have the power cord adapter. On the bottom, you have the battery compartment. And it comes with four batteries, which they put under the monitor. The unit doesn't come with the power adapter, but it can be purchased separately at any time. And I've included a link down below for that and the unit itself. It's probably the only con I have about this monitor. I wish they included the wall outlet adapter, but most monitors don't include it. And it's not needed to use it, but it's nice to have if your batteries are drained and you don't have any new ones at the moment and you want to take your blood pressure. Okay, this is the cuff with the attached air supply hose. The cuff has some markings on it, like the distance it should be from the crease of your arm, the size range arm that the cuff is made for, and the artery marker here that you'll line up with the artery in your arm once the cuff is wrapped around your arm. The metal connector attaches by pushing it onto the connector until it snaps into place. To pull it off, pull back on the metal sleeve and pull the hose away. You'll see threads at the end here. This is made to connect onto some other monitors. This monitor doesn't require you to screw anything on, so it may confuse some at first. It did to me. It's just push on and pull off only. That's it, the monitor is ready to go. And all you have to do is press the power button and it will start measuring your blood pressure, which we will do in a moment. The monitor connects to your smartphone by downloading an app where your readings will automatically be transferred and stored. Visit your app store, search for the Welch Allen Home app, this is the one you want, press get, and download it to your phone. Once you create your account, you'll get to this screen. Choose I have a blood pressure device. Press and hold the power button for two seconds to pair the monitor to your phone. It found my device. Press save. It also gives you the option to name your device. For now, I'm going to keep it my blood pressure device. Choose save and then press done adding devices. And that's it, it's all connected to my phone. Everything's set up and ready to go. I'm gonna pause the video, give myself five minutes of quiet time like you're supposed to, and then we'll be right back to take my measurement. Thank you. 
123, not so bad. I was expecting worse because it's in the middle of making a video and I recently ate a snack. This morning it was 108 over 67, which is typical for me in the morning. So it shows how much your pressure can fluctuate during the day, depending upon what you're doing. The cuff inflation feels very comfortable, and I'm not the only one saying that when you read the reviews. It doesn't squeeze your arm as bad as other monitors. And it only took 20 seconds to measure, which is faster than most. The downside is past results can only be read in your app, and it's only made for one user, even though anyone can use it. And as I mentioned before, it doesn't come with a power cord, so you must use battery power if you don't purchase the wall plug. That being said, there's so many pluses. The app will store all your readings and keep them in lists, graphs, and generate reports, which you can email to yourself or your doctor. The display has a dark background, with easy to read large numbers that has a contrast, not that gray on gray you see so much with other monitors. It's easy to use, has quality parts, like the metal air hose connector, while others are made of plastic. But the most important are the quality and accuracy of the device, which is the most important and why I highly recommend this monitor to anyone. It makes no sense to monitor your blood pressure at home if it's not going to get accurate readings. If you want to check the current price, I left a link for you down below. If you found any value in this video, click the thumbs up, and I wish you and your loved ones the very best.